I hope I'm not too late for the funeral. Why, no. No, not at all. Oh, thank goodness. I would have felt just terrible if I'd missed it. She was one of my dearest friends. Did you hear that, Dorothy? One of her dearest friends. Yes. Oh, my. Well, we've been friends for nearly 60 years. Would, would you mind saying a few words? Me? Mind? Well, I, I'd be happy to. Uh, happy. Right. Oh. Uh, today is a day of great sadness. Not only for me, but also for the many people whose lives have been touched by the warmth and the kindness of this woman who is lying here. I wish I knew how many charities and hospitals and orphanages have benefited from her generosity. But now no one will ever know because she preferred to do all of her good work anonymously. I'm sure that a lot of people never even knew that she worked for 15 years in a leper colony. <laughs> yes, Celia Rubenstein loved all mankind. <laughs> she was... Oh! <laughs> Celia Rubenstein. This funeral isn't for Celia Rubenstein, it's for Frida Claxton. <gasps> The Rubenstein funeral is down the hall. Oh, I am so sorry for the intrusion. Uh, Frida Claxton, wasn't she the woman who owned that old house on Richmond Street? Yes. Oh. <laughs>